hey hi hello welcome to another video in this video we will be looking into how to perform sheet level access using show condition in sheet properties okay so within this app i have two sheets one is always visible and on this sheet we will be applying the show condition so let's quickly get into it before starting the video i would like to discuss about os user function because it would be important OS user function returns the user ID of the user who is accessing the dashboard. So as I am accessing the dashboard from Clicksense desktop, it is returning as personal slash me. But if you are accessing it from Clicksense enterprise, then you would be able to see the domain name slash the user ID. Okay. I hope your OS user is clear. Uh, let's now get into the show condition. Okay, here basically I'm using mix match. Mix match is similar to match, but it is case insensitive. So uh, here within it, I'm using OS user and then I'm specifying the user who should have access to this sheet, right? Uh, now, as you can see, when I click apply, I'm able to access the sheet. But if I add a not in front of this, right? I will lose my access to the sheet. So if I click on done editing, right? and uh, i click here and i'll go to always visible so as you can see i'm not able to access the access that sheet okay yeah. uh, if that application was published i won't be able to access it but as this is not published right what i can do is i can click on edit sheet and then i can go to that sheet pack and i can access it okay for end users until they don't have uh, editing access right they won't be able to access that sheet that specific sheet i hope that is clear now, if you want to automate this, right, uh, adding uh, every time a new user you want to add into this uh, expression, right, uh, uh, coming here and adding it, it is not a feasible task. So to automate it, right, what you can do is you can load a separate table. You can load the data from the AD, okay, or you can load the data from some other data source and you can do, you can do even uh, some specific groups needs to have access to the sheet, uh, uh, that kind of operations using uh, by loading the data from ad or uh, any other data source and then once it is loaded right the user ids are loaded right what you can do is you can come into the sheet and i have created a variable here okay i'll share the very uh, uh, variable definition in the description below basically i'm using concatenate uh, concat and using the concat i am building uh, the second third fourth and how on the number of users which are available in that field right uh, that number of parameters for our mix match function okay uh, i'll, I'll uh, uh, paste that uh, in the uh, uh, description below okay now if i come here right uh, and if i'll just need to do v users okay i'll remove the not so first of all we'll see I'll be able to access the sheet. See. Now what I'll do is I'll quickly add a knot in front of it. And I'm not able to access it. I hope the simple video on sheet level access is clear to you. If you found this interesting, do it on the like button. For more interesting videos on ClickSense like this, make sure you subscribe and click on the bell icon next to it so that you get a notification whenever I upload my new videos. Thanks for watching. Until next time, have a good time.